Hey there YouTubers, all right, unboxing video time. This is another case. So I actually just sold off the old flagship gaming computer, which uh, actually kind of makes me sad. Um, this case I don't think is going to replace that one in my heart, but we'll see. This is a do-it-yourself PC, and the part number is DIY-81. A1-W. So let's go ahead and get her open. And uh, I do have, uh, that was a Matrix uh, 55 that I just sold off. Um, I did take my my good components out of it. But uh, guy wanted a case, so he got my case. Um, didn't like the other cases I have, I guess, for sale. But uh, yeah, we are... Uh, we're getting a Matrix 55 soon. Uh, either, let's see, today's Monday, Tuesday, or um, Wednesday. I actually have the Matrix 55 in. Looking forward to that. Wow, so these guys actually put a piece of foam um, between the cardboard and the glass. That is, uh, I'll tell you what, do it yourself. Big thumb up for that. I'm so tired of these guys doing a lousy job of uh, packing these things. It's almost like, do they care if this stuff could be broke? So, I don't know if you're thinking what I'm thinking, but the white, um, what was I thinking? I showed them black. Two different colors of white, okay? We got cheap plastic and aluminum here, and they are not even the same shade. Um, so, oh well. Now this item, uh, available through Newegg, and uh, it's about, I think, $39, maybe $40, somewhere in there. We'll just say with tax. And I, might, I don't know if I had to pay for shipping. I either had to pay for uh, tax or uh, shipping, maybe even both. So it's kind of a bummer. All right, so let's go ahead and stand this up. Oops, we're gonna break the camera. All right, so we're gonna talk about the features of this here case as soon as I get this off here without breaking it. And uh, so far, you know, in the I'll call it low-end computers um, because anything, in my opinion, under $50 for a case is uh, a low-end computer case. So far, nothing has beat the uh, Matrix uh, 55 now, or excuse me, yeah, 55. Now, I do have a 50 coming, which I do believe uh, has some of the things that I wanted the 55 to have. So I think we're gonna be even happier with the knife waist when we actually accidentally stab ourselves. All right, so obviously uh, on this side of the computer we got tempered glass. Still got the plastic wrap on it, which is good. I uh, will get fingerprints all over it <laughs> and on the inside, <coughs> like I always do, excuse me. Now on the front of this case, um, thumbs down for only one USB 3.0, Gen 1 there, two 2.0s, uh, one headphone, microphone, one of those is your hard drive light, reset and power. So that's that guy. Up here, oh, it is magnetized, good. So it's always nice to have the vent cover uh, actually have that on it. And let's go ahead and uh, I'm gonna put it on its side. We'll take the glass off. And it's gonna be very easy to take the glass off. Just gonna unscrew these guys. And they should have a little rubber piece between, nope. Oh, there it is. Stays on the glass, that's weird. So most of the places you got that little uh, washer or whatever you want to call it. Um, this one actually is sticking to the glass. That surprises me. 
I'll put that in my pocket. So we're doing, we're uh, making this video in a different studio today. This is a uh, Studio B. All right, so let me uh, let me check the food. I'm actually cooking dinner uh, in Studio B for the the crew. So give me a second. All right, so back to this. Now, what do we see in here? We've got uh, one case fan, and uh, it's got white blades on it. I don't know if that lights up. I can't remember. Um, probably does not. Got a bag of hardware, the usual stuff, you know, the uh, extenders, screws, the little speaker for when it uh, boots up so you can hear it beep. Here is a nice, oh, nice little uh, color installation manual. So they must have heard me complaining. And, uh, you know, I do have some good news. I may get picked up for a sponsorship uh, from another company. So... Though it might seem like I'm bashing these guys, um, I'm actually, you know, telling it like it is. So I will do the same with that other company if they send me a crappy product. All right, so, and, you know, probably not have that sponsorship very long. All right, so we got uh, HDD installation, blah, blah, blah. Let's just walk through this. Now, this one has a fully enclosed area for your uh, power supply. And it looks like there's going to be a hard drive thing. Here's a one of those crappy vents I hate. I wish they would uh, make those magnetized too. I'm pretty sure that one's not. All right, on the inside, standard cables. You've got your USB 3.0. You've got uh, USB 2.0. There should be an HD 97 HD audio cable. Probably right, yeah, right there. There's your uh, audio. And then... These are going to be your HDD LED, your reset switch, your power LED. Um, I can't read the other ones. Which one did I forget, folks? Reset, power, power LED, power switch. Okay. All right. So that's that's what you get for cables. Standard stuff. Uh, the fan. Wow. This fan is only uh, hooks up to MOLED, so. If that's the case, there's a, you would think there's a good chance that there will be a light in it because most of your uh, lights, your fans with lights, require a MOLED connector. So overall thoughts of this, uh, it feels pretty cheap. Um, wow, these things are freaking on here tight. They don't want you to get in there. It's almost like, uh, I don't know if I have a, there we go. We can get in here so um, yeah you know in the same price range once again is your uh, deep cool matrix and it uh, as long as it stays in that price range it is a much better deal than this uh, this case is sorry do it yourself but uh, that's that's just the honest to gosh truth all right so Obviously, you've got, uh, you know, cavity in there to hide your cables. Um, and obviously, now that we've got it off, you can start to see. You can see all of the uh, areas where you're going to pass your cables through to the other side. What I don't like is there's no real hooks here. Um, to do your tie-offs. Um, actually, there is. Okay, so for routing purposes, you'll want to run your um, your tie-offs through these points. So they're in there. So it pretty much has everything you need. Your hard drives are down here, and uh, you know this is uh, this isn't too bad. It's sharp edges. I don't like that. Uh, decent tray though. So that's good. Three and a half inch drives here. Two and a half inch here, two and a half inch there. Uh, I think that's all you have for extra hard drives. Power supply will be in here, which will be nice and hidden, so you don't have that eyesore. Um, unless you have the, you know, the modular ones, which are sharp. Uh, looks like two case fans. One, two, maybe. One, two. Yeah, you can only get two case fans in the front. So, for you newbies out there, you want to get your air flowing this way. Uh, 
and if you can't afford the ones on top, basically you're pushing air this way, or uh, if you have the fans up here, push in this way and up and out. So good, very good case for that uh, part, and uh, yeah, not too bad. I, uh, I'm happy with this purchase, so thanks for checking out the video. Dinner is done. Please like, please subscribe.